Hello everyone, this is Trafalgar Valentine. How's it going today? Today I'll be doing a bird drawing. Today I'll be doing a toucan. So, where to start? I might just go on a little bit of pencil just to get me a few shapes. So for the body, I do a semicircle shape. Hmm. Where this is actually on the paper. I might do this a bit further back, so around there. And then we'll start with the head shape, which will be around there. And then the beak will come out. Like so. The wings will come around here and down. And then the feet over here. And it's going to be sitting on a tree branch around there. Okay, I don't like to go on too much into pencil. Um, but let's go ahead in the pen. Let's just start inking this. Okay, let's start with the wings on the top. This is just 0 0.3 Uniball pencil. You could try this if you wanted in pencil first. I just want to go. I'm quite of a rush, so I just need to do this in pen. Okay, so I'm just going to start with some feather shapes. Just point them down and draw it back up. Keep these ones smaller. Then do the same for another layer. And these ones, keep them very long. So like exaggerated C shapes, but I'm trying to go into the same lines as I've just made there. Okay, and then start with the head shape. And I'm just going to do a solid block line here, like so. Just do a few lines. Okay, let's do the eye. So I'm just doing a circle shape, leaving this little white highlight in the center. I'll do another one around it. I haven't filled this line, I've just done a little dot. Like so. Then this bit part is going to be in white, so I'm not going over there, I'm just feathering the lines a little bit. And come back up. Okay, let's follow the rest of the body down. Could do some thin C shapes just to indicate the feathers, but keep them smaller than the wing. Just around. We do some on top of the head here. Okay, and then for the I've, I've tried to keep the flow of the body going down, but for the feet, I'm going to go in the opposite direction. Well, a different angle. This one's going to be straight down. Just a column. Column of feet. And then here is where the toes are going to be. Now these are like in segments, so they're going to come round. One's there. I'll just curl this round like so. And we'll do the same for the other side. This one's gonna be a little bit pointed away, so I'm just gonna start on this tree branch and just curl that round. And I'm not gonna follow that exact shape, I'm gonna follow the line of the tree branch and start there and then curl that round again. This side, this one's slightly longer. Then do the segments, curl it round. It's not straight up and down, it's a slight curl in it. Then the tree branch, come here. Then we'll have to do the tail, which will come down. Just 
flick that up. That's going to be almost jet black, so there's not much detail there. Okay, let's do the beak. So I'm just going to pivot my hand across. Get a small circle like so. Just remember the slower you go, the more wobbly it's going to be. So the faster you can do it, the smoother the line's going to be. I'm just do a few lines, jagged lines there. And it's going to curl off to a point. That'll be in black. So sort of screeching this one, so it's got a tongue hanging out. Let's do a little funky little tongue. So curl this one up a little bit, then back down. And follow the same shape. Little jagged lines. Come back down. And then for the tongue. Very, very lightly in the centre. Okay. Let's uh, get some colour in there because it's starting to look a bit weird. Maybe let's start with the beak. I'm just going to do a red tint, just these darker areas. And then bring it up for these like crooked lines. And do the same on this side. Like so. I'm just going to highlight that red just with an orange. And the same in this side. I'm just going to do that center tongue bit just in a bright pink color. Okay, now I'm going to go in pencil, so I'm just going to fill this in a slight orange tinge first. Maybe bring it right up there. Doesn't matter if you go over the lines that you just did before, because it kind of smooths them out. Then we'll go with the yellow pencil. And we'll kind of blend that in. So I've never actually drawn one of these before, so it's my first time. So, if there's any problems with it, that's my excuse. Okay, so I'm going to do the start doing some more details on the feathers. So I'm just going to shade it all in black. I might actually just uh, smudge the pencil across this to make it just slightly darker. So I'm not doing too fancy, just going around all the edges. There, I'm just going to smooth it out. Just I run my hand across it. I'm just going to do a few dark. This is going to be white, this little part here. I'm just going to do a few lines across. This is going to be darker grey. Do some more detail with the pen after that. I get do all these tail feathers in black, just to emphasise it because it's far away. It's, well, it's the furthest away from the bird, and it'd be the darkest part of the whole thing. Is that a correct term? <laughs> just so. Okay, now I'm just going to do some lines on the feathers. Just doing some lines going across and down. So Let's do some lines from this side. A 
if I'll curl this round at the top. Like so. Okay, I'm going to go under black uh, pencil again, maybe just darken up the rest of it. Some darkened lines just on this edge. So just going in and around some of the feathers that I've drawn on the feet. Doing slight dashed lines, nothing too fancy. A few lines in the, there. Might end a bit of a blue tinge just on this eye. And for the feet, I'm just going to go with a small brown pen. Just around here. And then I'm just going to do some more details in this tree branch. I'm going to do some lines going across it. Doing a few shapes here and there. branch in a slightly darker brown colour. A yellow pencil just on the feet, just to bring them out a little bit. I'm going to darken up this uh, bird a bit because I don't like the consistency that it has. Maybe have some darkened edges, just smoothing out. Okay, slowly going there just with a black pen. Darkening up some areas around the feet. Maybe a thick line across the tree branch. Let's add a bit of a blue tinge behind him. Let's 
see a slight green tinge on this tree branch. Smoothing out the pencil lines that I did. Got a brown pen just for the tree branch. We'll do a few more lines on it. Just like so maybe I think the eye needs a bit more brown. Let's go with the light brown pen. Just like so, just want to smooth this head out a bit. There's my uh, fun little screeching to toucan. It's just been a small drawing, but I hope you enjoyed it. Maybe draw your own little toucan or something. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. I'll be back with another video quite soon.